Hey folks, so, <laughs> so last week, went to Walmart, saw that they had some Morcana, they weren't marked uh, price-wise, and so, you know, I went, I had the Walmart app on my phone, I scanned them, they seemed to be incredibly overpriced, they didn't have uh, the gift set, but they had these, and the website said 40 bucks, and I was like, absolutely not, I thought they were a little, little too expensive, anyway, <clears throat> I went home, uh, did some research, found out the actual prices, and I went, well, wait a second, this is, you know, a lot cheaper than I thought it was. Uh, at Walmart, these were marked for uh, 20 so I went back, but needless to say, they were all gone uh, the exact same day I went back <laughs> later on that afternoon. Anyway, so needless to say, this week, uh, I went to a local Target, and I actually came across um, a live restock. There were two young ladies, they were uh, restocking the shelves. And they were incredibly nice. Uh, you know, I've seen a bunch of videos where I hear about the people that do the restocking are rude, impolite, uh, what have you. Uh, this was absolutely not the case. The absolute opposite. These ladies were nice. They were like, hey, how are you doing? What are you looking for? Um, I just said, you know, I'm just looking. And they said, well, we have the new Disney Lorcana. If, you know, I'm here. And I was like, oh, okay. And even better, they knew the prices. Uh, these were six bucks. And these are actually better than Walmart. These were six bucks. Uh, these were seventeen as opposed to twenty at Walmart. And they actually had uh, the gift set. And I don't remember the Walmart's having gift sets, but at Target they have them, and they were thirty bucks. So for all three, it was a little bit over fifty dollars. So that's not too bad. And uh, <clears throat> like I said, uh, these ladies were more than nice. They were putting, you know, they seemed to, uh, they, well, <laughs> I'll put it this way, they gave the impression that. They weren't sure exactly what was popular or, you know, what was everybody wanting. They were just putting stuff on the shelves. Um, but there was absolutely no line whatsoever. People weren't jumping over each other for these things. But I did see some videos. I think it was Lively, card collector, who uh, he, he was showing a line at his local Target and everybody was wanting these things. So uh, there is a demand out there for them. And like I said, at the Walmart, these were already gone. Uh, within <laughs> within less than a day. So I just consider it my good fortune. And like I said, it was cheaper at Target. So in my personal opinion, go to your local Target and uh, hopefully you can find these. Like I said, uh, this was six, these were 17, and uh, this was 30. So anyway, that's pretty cool. And so without further ado, I know I've talked <laughs> with, <laughs> for about three minutes here. Um, we're going to go ahead and open these, these these three things up, see what's in here, see if it's worth the hype. Uh, <laughs> I'm not much into uh, uh, Disney, but, you know, I figured it'd be pretty fun to open these up and, and share it with you guys. But before we do that, you can always do me the favor. Uh, you can always subscribe to the channel, hit that subscribe button. And if you like what you see, you can always hit that like button as well. We've had some uh, decent growth over the past few weeks. Uh, which has been phenomenal. I greatly appreciate it. And uh, if you guys haven't uh, subscribed yet, uh, feel free to do so. All right. So let's go ahead and get started. We're going to go ahead and open up uh, the booster pack first. Just put these off to the side. So I guess a hanger pack, if you will. This was actually hanging on a peg. This is uh, 12 cards. So for seven bucks, this is about <laughs> it's less less than a dollar a card, I guess. If my math is correct, like seventy or eighty cents per card. All right, who do we have? We have Duke of Wesselton or Weaselton, if you uh, are familiar with the movie. We have Maleficent. We have Aladdin. Minnie Mouse. Friends on the other side, Captain Hook, Ariel, Kronk, I, I love the guy who, who does his voice, uh, Patrick Warburton, uh, Cut to the Chase, Captain Hook again, we have uh, Maui, and then we have, looks like, oh, I, it jumped out of my hands, then we have Aladdin again, is this... Looks like it's look like it's a foil Aladdin. So, and I believe these uh, emblems on here will tell you whether or not it 
it's a rare or, or legendary or what have you. <clears throat> and then looks like we have like a little puzzle piece or something like that. So that was uh, the booster pack. I believe the most one of the most popular ones out there is uh, the Elsa legendary card, if you will. I <laughs> I okay, you know. Uh, this is one of the many. Uh, uh, starter decks they have. I think there are three at the moment. Sorry if, for it being blurry. But this one has Cinderella and Mufasa. The other one has Maleficent and Aladdin. And the third one has uh, Moana and somebody else I don't remember. So uh, I will say on the side uh, what what it, the contents are. So I'm, I didn't really look at it. I like to be surprised. How do I... I'm sure there are a lot of people out here who are uh, playing the game. Now, granted, you know, oh, I'm just dropping stuff everywhere. Now, granted, when my kids were younger, chances are we would have purchased these for the pure fact of letting them play. But, uh, <laughs> it's for, for, Six dollars a booster pack. I, oh, it comes with a booster pack as well as the starter deck, so that's pretty cool. I'm trying to see if I dropped anything more. Looks like almost looks like one of those uh, ice cream sandwiches that you would get. <laughs> All right, we have Aurora from uh, Sleeping Beauty. Looks like we got a few of those. And then uh, Simba, another Aurora. So I found her. Grandma Tala. I like her. Uh, Jasmine. Maleficent. Looks like we have a lot of Maleficent here. Another one. Uh, Mickey Mouse as a detective. Uh, Mufasa. Scar. Develop your brain. Okay. That might be... Uh, I'm, I'll be nice. One jump ahead. <laughs> uh, coconut basket. Uh, magic golden flower. The beast. Captain Hook. Uh, goons. Uh, Hercules. Kristoff. Maui. Prince Eric. Simba. Fire the cannons. Gravy Sword, Ransack, Smash, and Frying Pan. So, I guess that's uh, the, the point of those is to be able to do a, a complete game. I'm sure there are a lot of kids out there uh, <laughs> playing the game. And I'm sure there's a lot of parents uh, keeping the foil ones. <laughs> Let's see what's in this uh Booster pack. Looks like we have another puzzle piece here. Vicious Betrayal. Mufasa. Abu. Timon. Tinkerbell. Captain Hook. Reflection. Tamatoa. Grandma Tala again. Ursula's shell necklace. Tamatoa again. A little bit different. And then lastly, we have. Looks like we have a foil of Zeus. That's pretty cool. Alright, on to the gift set. So the gift set has uh, two oversized uh, foil cards. And then also here at the bottom it says it comes with four booster packs. Uh, the tokens, two playable fo foil cards, and... Uh, like I said, two oversized foil cards and more. Mm, I wonder what the what the more is. Well, they they pretty much make sure that you once you open it, it's staying open. <laughs> it's not one of those with goodness gracious. So 
right out here, right out, right out the bottom. Okay. I'm just tearing into this thing. So that's where uh, the scorecards are. Here are the oversized cards. Trying to get into it without. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> well, that was fun. Tell me, Art. Is anybody out there actually playing this game, or are you guys just buying it for uh, the ability to collect? Let me know. Post in the comments below. Alright. So for the two oversized foil cards we have. We have Hades. That's pretty cool. He's got long hair. Then we have Mulan. Well, that's pretty uh, that's pretty awesome for the foil cards we're gonna go ahead and open up uh, the pack it looks like we have the same foil cards we have Hades and Mulan all right not too bad not too bad and then we have the, f the four different packs out there. Who do we have? We have Mickey Mouse, we have Maleficent, and it looks like we have two with Elsa. So that's pretty cool. And they have 12 cards in there apiece. We're going to go ahead and uh, open the Mickey Mouse once again. We'll, we'll save Elsa for last. We have Megara, Mickey Mouse Detective, Peter Pan, Simba, Jafar, Aladdin, Mickey Mouse, Beast, Captain, Just in Time, Robin Hood, and then Pascal. That's our our foil. Okay. Tell me if I'm if I came across anything that was absolutely <laughs> awesome here. Like I said, I'm not sure exactly which ones are the legendary. All right, second pack. Isma, and that uh, was like the emperor's new groove. Or something like that. Stellan Scimitar. Aurora. We have a lot of her. Tangle. Stitch. Simba again. Dragonfire. Sven. Jamba Jukiba. Flotsam. Where's Jetsam? A whole new world. And then, ooh, we have a... That's pretty cool. A Flaming Scar. And that's our foil. I like that one. That was a pretty cool one. All right, on to the Elsa pack number one. All right, the genie. Another Aurora. <laughs> Sergeant Tibbs. Stitch again. Isma. Hercules. Pascal. Cheshire Cat, Bell, Maleficent. I like some of this artwork. It's pretty cool. Doctor Fastlier, and then we have Jetsam. That's pretty cool. All right, and our last booster pack. I like some of the artwork that they have. Oh, 
Looks like we got a little blurry there. Let's get a little focus. There we go. Alright, we have the wardrobe. Aladdin again has Prince Ali. Ali Ababwa. Merlin. We have Minnie Mouse. Sebastian. There we go. Tinkerbell. Triton. And then we have Have You Forgotten Me? Lilo. Yago. Ariel. And then we have Scar once again. I'm guessing this is our. Guessing. Uh, <laughs> I'm guessing that's our legendary emblem there. <laughs> Still, that's pretty cool. So, no. No, uh. Elsa. Uh, foil. But that's okay. We, uh. I mean, uh, like I said, I think the cards look pretty cool as far as uh, some of the artwork and, and what have you. Um, and in all honesty, do I see myself playing the game? Absolutely not. Do I see myself buying any more of these? Uh, probably, probably not. Uh, <laughs> so that's pretty much uh, the, the most of the video. I, there's not much more uh, to it. Uh, it. It's all cool. It's all cool. I, I'm glad uh, people are into this. Uh, like I said, do I see myself buying any more of these? Probably not. Um, I was hoping, you know, maybe we'll get some halfway decent cards. But I'll take a look, see what we have here, and, and see what I, how they uh, price out there in the in the world of eBay. Um, but it was all good. But tell me what you guys think of this video. Did you see some cards out there that you guys liked? Let me know. Post in comments below. And uh, I'll see you guys next time.